All right, we are gonna do some as seen on TV survival. Does it really work? Using two beer cans, 100% cotton of some type of cloth, and some motor oil. Stick with me. I've seen this uh, on one of those television survival shows, um, SOS with Creek Stewart. You know, Creek Stewart, I actually like him. I think he's a pretty good, you know, instructor, survivalist, informational guy. Um, kind of no nonsense, you know, no BS kind of stuff. Kind of like a Les Stroud in a way, you know, just kind of common sense stuff. But he did this. He made, it was for, it was uh, this. The story was that they could, on the show, if you've never seen the show, they kind of do, uh, they actually talk to people who's got themselves into situations and have survived and, you know, and things like that. And what they could have done that might have helped them, you know, do a little better. There, there's a woman who was trapped in a, a, a car and a snow passed, you know, snow passed um, road and things and got, got stuck and was out there for days, you know. Didn't have any heat or anything like that, you know, or the car was, you know, buried in snow and things like that. But what one of the things was is that if you have any kind of, these are beer cans, they could be anything, you know, of course, you know, you don't want to really have too many open beer cans in your car, but he did mention beer cans because they did have beer cans apparently. But, uh, so, you know, like a lot of us, you know, you take your, you drink your drink, you know, or you pour it into a cup, you know, a lot of us. You just throw it back behind the car seat, you know, so in the back in the back passenger side, you know, so anyway a lot of times we'll have some type of cans in our cars So he made a stove basically to help Keep some heat and offer some comfort peace of mind with light at night things like that So we're gonna see if this works. It's actually very easy Let's do it. All right, I'm gonna get you up here. So you can see what I'm doing. First of all, we're gonna start off by taking one of these cans and putting a hole right here. Kind of get that. And then another hole right there. another one over here for grins all right and we're gonna take this so that's what I did you see where I'm going with this already And then they showed putting slits in here like this. And I would imagine this would be for just getting it in there as ease. All right, now we're gonna do, make a window here.
All right. Now through the magic of TV. <laughs> Pour a little bit of oil in there. Doesn't have to be a whole lot. I cut off a piece of this 100% cloth cotton rag. A lot of times we all have rags in the bottom of our uh, bottom of our cars somehow, some way. Try not to make a mess here. Alright, and then what I'm gonna do kind of thread that through. Dump that back in there. That's what the cuts are for. Get it in there. It's kind of slick now. Uh, let me wipe my hands off. See, that's why it's a good thing to have part of a rag, too. Of course, through the magic of TV, they made it all pretty and nice and neat. Yours ain't gonna be, and neither is mine. There we go. There we go. Kind of push that back down in there a little bit. So basically what you've done is made you a lamp and a lantern. Like that. Does it work? That's already hot up here. And yes, it works. Outstanding. Now on the on the show, they showed a taller can like a, you know, a big monster can or a big tea or something, you know, the the uh 32 ounces or whatever, the big ones, you know, the big cup, the big cans, which would probably work even better. But however, that is putting out a lot of heat. That is getting very warm. It's cool down here. Now it's gonna be smoky. So you'll wanna crack a window and everything. And because that's what the deal was, is that in the, uh, in the scenario that they were talking about, the, the woman was trapped in, a, in her car. The woman was trapped in her car and been there for days and it was snowing and it was cold and she didn't have any way to heat herself because the gas was out of the car all this stuff you know so it was just everything that was against her and it was like these are just some common things that you can find in your vehicle most likely that you can actually get some heat and some light at night but see how smoky it is this stuff you know being motor oil it's gonna it's gonna stink but once it gets burnt down a little bit and everything, that should that's putting out that's putting out a little bit of heat. So if you know if you crack your window and all that, so that's all very hot. It's even hot down here. But it's a good emergency emergency uh, lantern heat source. So that's my idea. That's testing out not my idea it's creek Stewart's idea i mean i don't know where he got the idea from but it's my idea to try it to see if it works and it works and man it does i can feel the heat rating off of it so if you're stuck in a car in a vehicle and heat you need some heat well that'll definitely work and i would imagine that when that burns down the oil burns off of it you can already see that it's the oil is quite uh is 
getting burn off of it, not too bad. So, not smoking near as much. But still putting out a lot of heat. The flame is actually calming down. So there, that's actually a pretty good idea. So, it should work. I would imagine you can do this in your house as well. If you have lantern oil, would be fantastic. Would work better, wouldn't stink, wouldn't be as bad. And you can burn it inside, so that's pretty good. Cat, you better watch out, there's a fire. All right, that is my video, as seen on TV. It works. I didn't have any doubt, actually. And it's very simple, very simple. You saw me make it, two cans of any of your choice. I would recommend, I think, the taller can just make to make sure the flame doesn't come out of the top and burn something but see now it's actually calming down and it's not too bad so actually a taller can would probably even you know can give it more of a heating area watch out cat would give more of a heating area to kind of radiate more heat so because all of this all this is hot that's not too bad There you go, keep it heavy.